Howdy folks and good morning from Ken Zone One Stop Motorsport Taming Jaya. Hey, I got that all in one sentence. Wow. So anyway, we're here with the uh, Waja, but uh, nothing to do with the Waja today. The Waja is running beautifully. She needs a, she needs a, she needs a wash badly, but uh, other than that, she's running really well. Uh, last thing I did to the Waja was actually get fine clothes on Shopee. I didn't know it actually had the word Waja on it, but uh, yeah, I'm talking about the uh, door visors, also known as an air press. I don't know why it's called an air press, but I got these on Shopee. Yeah, that's me. Hey, folks, what's up? So yep, got those on Shopee for about. I think it was 20, 27 ringgit, I think, just just for fun. I've been buying so much stuff for the other cars, I figured I should do something with the uh, Waja. So anyway, why are we here at Tamin Jaya in Ken Zone Motorsport? Well, let's go in and have a look. The reason why we're here is because Bobby has sent in his Fiat 127. Now, I don't know if you guys know, but uh, Bobby loves this car. And look at the rims all nicely refurbished. There's Ken over there. He's a bit busy, so I won't catch up with him just yet. But uh, look at the rims. Those are tech, those are freaking magnesium alloy rims and the shavings can actually catch fire. You can actually watch a video of that. So the reason why we're here today is for the little kimchi, my KKK, my Korean K car. Yeah, as you can see, the wrapping hasn't been done yet, but we're doing the tint. So yes, Kenzo and Taming Jaya also does tint. We're going for something rather dark at the back. As you know, at the back is unlimited. Here is 50%, there is 70%. What's the difference between 50 and 70? 50% 50 VLT means it's like half a shade of tint. 70% you need to have at least 70% light transfer going through the front windshield, yeah? So it's 70, 50 and unlimited. So yes, they're doing lots of tint these days. There's a, there's a Honda back here, I think. Is it a Honda? I'm not sure the front end has been changed, but uh, Oh, that's Ken. Hi, Ken. Hi, hi. What's up? How are hi. you? All good? Okay. <laughs> so here we go. We're doing the back end as well, and uh, should be should be quite quite good. So I think we're going for like uh, seventy percent at the back, fifty percent in front, and seventy percent VLT at the back. Seventy percent at the back. Actually, no. It should be. I should say thirty percent at the back. Thirty percent VLT. Okay. Ah, forgot I already fit those at Procast the other day. So she's getting there, yep. As you can see, the um, headlights have been polished, the rims have been done, new tires. AK has actually prepped the body, and uh, so we're going for the tint. So as, as always, it's, it's a mechanical, electrical, peripheral, yeah? So mechanical stuff, do all the mechanical stuff first, do all the electrical stuff first, and then the peripheral. Peripheral means body, interior. Thankfully, this interior is still quite good, so no need to do nothing on the interior. Happy, happy about that. But uh, many of you don't know, but this used to be my car. Then it, I sold it off or traded it, I can't remember. I think I traded it for the 6 Series. And then uh, Ramesh, my late friend Ramesh, sold it off to somebody else. And then he bought it back. And uh, then he passed away and it went to somebody else. And, uh, and now it's with Bobby. I'm so happy this car is back in the family. It's still a lovely, lovely car to drive. Yeah, three pedals, baby. Uh, still a wonderful little car to drive. Bobby's got some plans for this car, I'm not sure what. But um, actually I know what, but I'm not going to reveal. Uh, let him reveal in due course. I mean, look at the size of it compared to uh, Ken's Cayenne. Look at that. Unbelievable. So yeah, drop by uh, Kenzon Taming Jaya. It's a much bigger place than Kenzon Taming Jaya. Lots of parking outside. As a Mr. DIY across the road, if you get bored, you can just go over there and spend money needlessly. Yep. But uh, stay tuned. So lots more gonna be happening soon. And uh, excited to see what the little Picanto is gonna look like after her tint job. Yes.
Yeah, sorry, I forgot to show you guys that the rock and roller, my ex rock and roller, is right here next to the Waja, looking really, really resplendent. White in the sunlight, one of the few cars that I painted stark white, angelic white, if I'm not mistaken, was the uh, code for it. But yeah, still the roller belonging to Justin. My rock and roller. Such a lovely, lovely car. Inspired many to do the same and get get a roller as well. Looking really nice. Looking really beautiful. And the Waja is running so well. Really, really so well. Okay, I'll, I'll let you in on a little secret, yeah? I have a, I have a project plan for the Waja, which uh, I know some of you will not agree with. And... Um, I'm also 50-50 about it right now. I, I'm not sure if I want to do this. It's a very invasive mod. Yeah, I'm thinking about converting the auto gearbox to a five-speed manual. I am definitely thinking about that. And the best thing about Kenzo and Taming Jaya, just behind them, is uh, a lot of chop shops. Kedai Kereta Potong. Yeah, so getting the parts will not be that difficult, but it's a very invasive very invasive uh, mod turning a converting a car from auto to manual this car's engine is just so amazing that i think paired up with a five-speed manual would be epic absolutely epic but it's a big job it's a big job i think second only to a full engine conversion is a gearbox conversion because it's not just getting an extra pedal no or getting just an extra gearbox it's a whole bunch of peripheral stuff that goes with it as well not to mention the labor it's very labor intensive it'll take about two weeks three weeks at least so yeah i'm still thinking about it tell me in the comments what you think about converting my waja 1.6 mmc into a manual because she runs really really well right now even as an auto but i think she will be absolutely fantastic as a manual so yeah Stay tuned. I still haven't decided I'm 50-50, really. <sighs> decisions, decisions, decisions. Thank you, Ake, for the uh, excellent, excellent paint job. Beautiful, beautiful color. <laughs>